Building a community is hard work. You might be asking yourself, where do I start? What do I need? Or even just what am I looking for? So we're going to compare two platforms, NASIO and Kajabi, to help you uncover some of the features that both of these platforms offer, and then you can make a decision on what works best for you. So let's start by taking a look at the main differences across the two platforms. When we look at NASIO, it's a platform to help build, manage, and grow communities. The slogan is bringing people people together. Kajabi too is a community facilitator with a focus on building courses. Kajabi's slogan is the best way to turn your knowledge into income. It's all built around communities, it's just a completely different focus that they're prioritizing. Now let's talk about what these platforms cost to use. Kajabi has a free trial for 14 days after which you have to pay a fee. This fee ranges from about 149 to 399 US dollars a month and they offer a discount if you pay annually. So yeah, you do have to pay to use the platform, but the whole point is there are monetization opportunities from your courses and the way you decide to charge beyond that is very customizable. So now let's look at NASIO. NASIO is actually free to use, but with that said, you can charge to enter and you can charge to access access files, like classes for example, and to join certain events. What NASIO does is just take a small commission off of that. NASIO does have additional options though. You have an option to pay a membership and host unlimited members, get more storage, get a personal account manager, and all of that costs 49 US dollars, so significantly less than Kajabi. Now if you're a business, there's also an option to get in touch and discuss a solution that's more customized for your needs. Now let's look at how easy it is to set up a community. On NASIO, you can very quickly give your community a name, upload a customized image, share a description about your community, and you get a custom URL for free. Even on the trailer, everything is about doing it all in two clicks. So everything is quick and you get a customized landing page at the end of it. So for example, if you're setting up a new course or even making any changes to an existing course, like the name of the host or a change in the time, of the event, all of that updates automatically on the landing page. So the entire process takes about five minutes or even less. So in case of any problems or a specific tech requirement, they've also got an on-demand support team to assist. Looking at Kajabi's setup, it looks way more customizable. If you need to make your page very branded besides the image, the name, or the URL, then Kajabi does have that option for you. They also have reference templates that help as a starting point, and they offer customization of URLs at no additional cost, but it does come under the paid subscription. What also stands out is that Kajabi offers unlimited landing pages. So if your business for any reason needs that, then that's what Kajabi offers. Now let's look at how these platforms facilitate communication with members. Kajabi is focused primarily on email communication. That's how you reach out to most of your members. Now here is one thing where NASIO really stands out. The communication options are a lot more extensive. NASIO integrates seamlessly with chat apps like Discord, Telegram, WhatsApp, and you can connect an existing chat or even start a new one. NASIO also has this feature called Magic Reach. What it does is that it finds the best way to reach each member, whether that's email, SMS, WhatsApp, it just sends the message across that channel to make sure that the member reads it. If you wanted to reach your members with email, you might be using MailChimp to reach them all at once. Magic Reach is similar. It's just free, easier to use, and it offers an opportunity to reach them in ways outside of just email. The other advantage is that you never lose your community. You can export the member information so for example, if you're using a Facebook group today and your members decide to leave tomorrow or something happens to Facebook and your group disintegrates, you will lose all the information. But here you can export the information and it's yours to keep. Now let's take a look at courses. Kajabi, in keeping with its focus on being a course builder, is dedicated to hosting courses. They have extensive course building tools. You can set up assessments, quizzes. You can even choose from various plans, right from mini courses to signature programs. They have it all. NASIO's course builder is very simple. You just upload your course, you name it, and you're done. You can also monetize it and it gets sent automatically to your community. 
community. So ultimately, if you want something extensive with a lot of course building tools, then that's what Kajabi has. If you want simplicity, if you have a course that's ready to upload and good to go, then that's what NASIO has. Now let's take a look at events. NASIO integrates with other platforms like Zoom and Google Calendar to provide event management and also live streaming. You don't need an account with the platform like Zoom. All you need to do is log into your NASIO account and launch the app from NASIO. The invitations get sent through Magic Reach and also appear on Google Calendar. There's no limit to the number of people that can attend the event. It can be anywhere from 10 to 10,000. Kajabi also allows you to create events. It allows you to create invitations for webinars. I don't find anything on live streaming, but what you can do is go through YouTube, live stream from there and send that link. Their events function is primarily for page launches and announcements, and you can also send the events through emails, of course. Now let's take a look at analytics. Kajabi has an extensive list, net revenue, subscription metrics, opt-ins, page views, product progress, offers sold, and affiliate commissions. NASIO has member size, new joiners, percentage unsubscribed, how diverse your community is, how active they are, and revenue. What it comes down to is that Kajabi's metrics are centered around the product, whereas NASIO's metrics are centered around the health of your community, and you also get suggestions for how to develop in weaker areas. NASIO is very intuitive to use and it also offers a weekly email summary of your analytics. We hope this comparison was useful and you were able to find which of the platforms suits you best. Let us know in the comments which other platforms you'd like for us to compare.